Nico Styler being canceled, like, what? Hey y'all, so I'm back with another video and for today's video I'm just going to be talking to you about this new Eco Styler being cancelled, like, what? Why? Nah, I know why. But honestly, I'm going to give y'all my opinion on it. I've been seeing other people's videos saying like, it causes cancer and like, is damaging to the scalp or something. Honestly, personally, I'm going to speak for myself. Um, I've been using Eco Styler for a while. Has never damaged my scalp. Has never irritated my scalp. It's literally like the best gel that I use on my hair. And honestly, I really don't use it that often. I switch up my gels a lot. I use different gels. I don't use Eco Styler like for every style. So the cancer part, I'm not really worried about. But... If you think about it, you know, so I don't know how you guys eat, how you guys live your life, but we eat things that can cause cancer, all that type of stuff, diabetes, all of that. So we, I'm, I'm not just going to say I'm the healthiest person. So, you know what I'm saying? We eat meat, we eat all that, all that stuff. It's a lot of stuff and everything that can cause cancer that's harmful to your body. Um, yeah, so we got to clean up, start cleaning up our whole lives, right? But yeah, Eco, this is literally, this is how much I use Eco Styler. Like, this is the only bottle, this is the only jar that I have, and it's brand new. I haven't even used the check. So I'm not really too worried about it. I feel like for people who may use it more often or have experienced irritated scalp or issues, or whatever it does to your scalp, if you've experienced that, you know, I would definitely recommend to stop using it. But as far as just canceling it all together, um, this brand new so I'm definitely about to use this I ain't canceling it because I never used it on a daily basis anyway so I ain't canceling it y'all can cancel it <laughs> that's my little piece on it Um, I try to live throughout other areas in my life the healthiest that I can I try to work out try to eat as healthy as I can but you know that, I don't, that doesn't always work but I'm working on it but I don't think no gel is just going to kill me off, so. Especially, like I said, I don't even use it that often, so. <laughs> I ain't throwing it away. Yo, I can. But what else was I going to talk about? Um, My life update. Y'all, life has just been getting so crazy for me. Like, I've never been this busy in my life. Like, I would just work, cheer my boyfriend and go home, like. I am super busy. Like, I have so much going on. I got so much that I'm getting into right now. I have i don't know if you guys know that I, I had a business. Pre I still have it. I had a business previously. I was selling um, hair products that I made. I had made hair products from when I was transitioning from um, relaxed to natural. Products, I swear, y'all, would just really not work for my hair. My hair was super, super dry, and I refused to big chop my hair I was not about to cut my hair off so my hair was extremely dry my curl pattern was non-existent and a lot of things just was really not working for my hair like products that work now just <laughs> literally did not work when my hair was damaged so I had to I did so much research people be asking me like did you go to school for this like no I didn't <laughs> I went to school for business like I ain't go to school for none of this like chemical stuff but honestly, I didn't need, I didn't use any chemical, like, what's the, I can't, let me look at this actually, names of things that are in certain ingredients, I didn't use all that stuff, what does it say, penoxalin, <laughs> penoxalinthin, lint, lintanol, like all that type of stuff, I didn't use that, uh, alcohols and all that, this was just straight natural stuff that I looked up on Pinterest, different oils that work for your hair, mixed together, what it does, and I just literally did my research for months. Like, this is how bad I wanted my natural hair to get healthy. So I researched and I made oils, shampoos, conditioners. Oh, I thought I spilled that. I made oils, shampoos, conditioners, um, hot oil treatments, a moisturizing spray. I just really went all in. Like, I did this much, this much research 
research <laughs> I contacted um, distribution companies. I was really trying to get this going. It didn't work out how I wanted it to, but I'm definitely coming back to it. But I actually still sell the oils because they are actually very popular. If you follow my hair journey, this is literally the only oil I use. This is what honestly has enhanced my hair growth. Like my hair is growing like crazy. Like I have these braids in. My hair is like... My hair is literally, my actual hair is literally right here, like braided into this. So, my hair growth has been honestly crazy. Make sure you guys watch my natural hair journey video. I'm going to link it right here. My hair growth has been crazy, and I'm going to credit it. I've, I use other products also, like now I use, um, I use Aussie, I use Miel Organics, Camille Rose. I use all different type of products now, but at that time, what really got my hair healthy was this was all I was using and once my hair got healthy I started switching up using different products because it worked on my hair now if that makes sense but my oils is what I still sell um if you've watched my flea market video I sell these at the flea markets I sell glasses I'll show you that in a minute I just want to finish talking about this oil I have it in like a spray for braids like I spray this on my braids to keep them moisturized I had these in for like a week and a half, two weeks, super moisturized. I spray this on my hair every morning. And I also have it in a bottle kind where, you know, you just drip it out in your hand for, like, when my hair is in the natural state. Y'all, I'm going to let y'all know when, I'm, when I've linked with a distribution company and I can get it in bulk. Because I really want to share this with you guys. I've really been working hard on these. Like, I've been doing this for, like, at least two years now, trying to get the... And this all natural oils. I don't put any extra products to nothing. It's all all natural oils. So I will be having that coming towards you. So I also sell sunglasses. Like, let me show you. I sell a lot of stuff. I got lipsticks. <laughs> I got so much stuff. But I'm not gonna do the lipsticks anymore because, like I said, I have to find a new distributor for. It's I actually have one of the colors on. But I have to find a new distributor, guys. When you're you when you want to start a company and you really don't know how to go about it my best advice is to do your research before you work with people because the distributor distributor that I worked with for my lipsticks was the it was the most horrible experience that I ever went through excuse me <clears throat> I didn't even want to like sell lipsticks anymore after working with her she was just so unprofessional but my boyfriend's telling me, like, don't let that discourage me. I'm going to find a new distributor, and I'm going to get these lipsticks going back again because this literally lasts all day. I love the I love the quality. Nah, I ain't going to say I love the quality. The quality's okay, but the lipstick does last all day, so can't be mad at her. Her just, her customer service is just terrible. But these are, I got, like, sunglasses. I got all different kind of styles. Like, I got these. I like these ones. I actually want to keep these for myself. Y'all, I'm so mad because the sunglasses I be wanting to keep, those are the ones that people be wanting to buy. I be so mad. Like, I wanted those. <laughs> but y'all know it's about this check. I also got, I got all different styles. But my purpose of telling you guys this is because I want to start, I want to, under my flea market video, one of my subscribers had asked if I, um, ever thought about putting it on eBay or Etsy or something I uh, I did have a website for all of this stuff you that for to be purchased but my website it had got deleted because I didn't pay the the monthly fee for it I mean not monthly the yearly fee but at the time the business just wasn't going like that for me to for me to pay it so I was thinking of different ways cheaper ways honestly to be able to sell to you guys or for you guys to check out what I have so y'all I'm feeling all of these glasses I don't know why I'm trying to buy. <laughs> but I've been finding um, more cost efficient ways to be able to sell to you guys get these products to you so like I said one of my followers said eBay or Etsy would be great so I may take you up on that I'm gonna check that out let you guys know when I get these products up there so you guys can go support she's like I want to support you put it up there so I'm definitely working on that I'm gonna do that for you guys 
And then y'all, along with all of that, I'm still, I still have a job. I work nights, so that way my days can be more spent on doing all of that stuff, basically recording, um, everything else I do, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what my days consist of. I'm, I, like I told y'all, I'm moving, so it's just a lot going on right now. So that is the reason why I haven't been recording as much. Um, but like I said, I'm coming back with it. I'm going to take these braids out soon. Like, are, am I the only one who literally keep braids in for like a week and a half, two weeks, and be ready to check for growth? Like, I'm, <laughs> I'm ready to take these out. My head itch. But, um, but, yeah, I have a lot more videos coming for you guys. Stay tuned. Stay tuned for this move. I'm supposed to... It should be coming beginning of August. I'm going to let y'all know. Um, yeah, I'm really excited for what I have coming. I'm not going to let y'all know all of that right now. But I'm excited. You guys should be too because at the end of the day, y'all the first ones to the y'all are the first. I'm not at 1k yet, but I'ma just speak it into existence. Y'all are the first 1,000 people to my channel. Y'all are my first babies. You know what I'm saying? So when I grow big and get to a million. Y'all was my first ones here. Thank you guys for your support. I love you all. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not already. And I think that really wraps it up. Um, thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys on my next video.